Therapeutic proteins, such as antibodies, are large complex molecules comprised of long-folded amino acid chains. The surface of these proteins have a high number of hydrophilic, ionic and polar groups, which help the proteins stay in solution. These hydrophilic groups enable the protein to form non-covalent bonds with itself or with neighbouring proteins. Small changes in protein conditions can affect non-covalent protein-protein interactions. This may cause the protein to form aggregates of protein molecules. Our own immune systems can see aggregates as antigens, producing anti-drug antibodies in response. This can lead to extreme immunotoxic responses in some patients. Due to this potential immunogenicity, monitoring of protein aggregates in biologic drugs is mandatory for patient safety and product quality. To monitor protein aggregates, we use a separation technique that differentiates molecules based on their size. Size exclusion chromatography uses a column packed with porous particles. Molecules are able to diffuse into pores in the particle. Large proteins, like antibody aggregates, are sterically excluded from most pores, so they quickly flow through the column. Mid-sized proteins spend more time diffusing into the pores and elute later from the column. The smallest proteins, such as antibody fragments, can diffuse into all pores and elute last. Unlike other chromatography techniques, size exclusion chromatography does not focus analytes at the head of the column. Consequently, chromatographic performance is dependent on dispersion within the chromatography system. Injection system, column diameter and union dead volume are all important considerations. Separation must be by size. It's important that there are no secondary interactions between the protein analyte and the column particle. Secondary interactions affect retention time robustness and can give poor peak shape. Some size exclusion chromatography columns are prone to robustness issues. Chromatographic system pressure spikes can deform particle pores over time, reducing column lifetime. Rust from metal surfaces in the system flow path can also block chromatographic particle pores, reducing column lifetime and method robustness. The clever scientists at Thermo Fisher Scientific have a solution. The Thermo Scientific Vanquish Flex UH PLC system is built for Biopharma, with an injector designed to minimize pre column dispersion, increasing separation performance, sensitivity, and reproducibility. The Smart Inject feature minimizes system pressure spikes, a truly biocompatible flow path means no rust can damage your column. The Thermo Scientific Viper finger-tight fittings have near zero dead volume for improved peak resolution. Our Thermo Scientific MabPak SEC1 columns have a unique particle coating which results in exceptionally low secondary interactions. Column oven controls and temperature stability mean that methods are easily transferred and optimised. You are able to confidently achieve high-resolution separations that are stable over hundreds of injections, saving you time and giving you a greater return on your investment, run after run.